Now, another thing that we've redesigned uh, on Android, um, on, on Honeycomb, is the notification system. And as you'll see, notifications are completely non-intrusive. They don't get in your way, just like on phones. But now they contain more information. So in this particular case, my friend Anand uh, is IMing me, and you can see his picture in the notification. And you can ignore it, or you can uh, uh, action it if you want. Um, what, we've, what we've done is we've built, maybe I should tell him to stop. Uh, what we've done is we've, we've built some templates that actually allow developers to create these richer, more advanced kind of notifications. And I'll show you a few of those. Uh, probably my favorite example is what I'm going to show you now. Um, there's a headphone notification at the bottom here. Uh, I, happen, I was listening to some music before getting on stage. And while the music app is active in the background, I get this notification that if I click on, will allow me to play pause or go to the next track, for example, like this. Yeah, it's from national underground, thunder pounds when I stop the ground. Like a million elephants, a silverback, a rank of tanks, you can't stop. And I can just pause that. Now, if I tap on the notifications area anywhere here on the bottom right, um, I'll be able to dismiss um, some of these um, notifications if I don't need them anymore. We call this a line item veto. And while I'm in the neighborhood, let me talk about the quick settings panel right here. This gives me quick access to important things uh, like airplane mode, Wi-Fi, and so on and so forth, just right there in one place. 